Hey, what is up, friends? Welcome back to a brand new video. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to root any Android device without using a computer, without using any custom recovery like TTAP URB or anything like that, without unlocking the boot of your Android device. Easy and simple. The method that I'm going to be using on this tutorial is the easiest and the safest method that I'm going to be using on this tutorial. It's gonna be working on any Android device, on any Android version, so it doesn't matter the phone you're using, it doesn't matter the version you're using, it's gonna be working working on it easily so let's get started but before we get started i want to ask you if you are not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel activate the notification to get notified about new video and let's get started let's get started first of all we need to make some changes on your android device so go to setting of your android we need to enable some setting on your android device get to setting of your android device scroll down to the last option about phone or about device or system in my case as you can see it is system just clicking on it about phone there you will find this option saying build the number we need to activate the developer app show so to do that to activate the developer app show we need to click on build the number around seven times to unlock the developer app show i have you already that i am already a developer as you can see no need you are already a developer so click on build the number around seven times by doing that you will have the developer option unlock it just a return and you will have their developer option if you can't find this option developer option just click right over here in the corner and the cheesy icon right over here and then you're going to type the developer option by doing that you will have that option developer option just click on it it's going to be just like this it will open up this window if it is disabled like mine as you can see it is disabled it's not working just to enable it by clicking right over here in the corner in this icon click it on it to enable click it okay if it ask you all right scroll down make sure to enable this option usb the blocking mode first of all enable the, the usb the blocking mode click it right over here in the corner to do that to enable it. click it okay if it ask you scroll down all right here on window animation skill you need to a uh, put the animation off animation off transition animation to the same process put the animation off as well as we did on window animation animator duration to the same process put the animation off as well scroll down find this option saying force gpu rendering are over here click it out over here in the corner to enable it. scroll down Make sure to enable this option saying for C4X MSAA. Enabled by clicking right over here in the corner. Alright. Alright, now I'm going to be showing you that I don't have root access installed on my Android device. So to do that, I'm gonna be using this application called the root shortcut. The link will be available on the description of this video in case you wanna know if your phone have root access or not. Just use this application, the link will be available on the description. Root Shaker. Or you can get this application on Play Store. Just click right over here on Verify Root. And by doing that, the application is going to verify and it's going to tell you if your phone has root access or not. As you can see, sorry, root access is not properly installed on this device. Okay, now everybody knows that I don't have root access installed on my Android device. Now, what you're going to do, you need to download the, the application that we are going to be using to get root access on our Android device. The link will be available on the description of this video. Download this application. The app will be in zip. You're going to use this application. The link will be available as well on the description of this video to extract the file you are going to use in this application. The link will be available in the description or you can get this application on Google Play Store. Just click on the file. By doing that, it will open up this window. What you're going to do, just click it out over here on extract to. We are going to extract the file. By doing that, the file will start to be is trying what you have to do be patient and wait a little bit all right once you have extract the file successful it will be created another folder 
as you can see just you click on the new folder and then you will find the application that we are going to be using to get the assets on our android device just click on it to install on your android device you don't need to worry about it this application it doesn't have a virus it's 100 in your device it's 100 percent safe just to download the application extract install on your android device all right install the application on your android device and open it up the app all right as you can see the application is going to be in chinese what are you going to do just to click it all over here and this option i don't know exactly what they say swap to the right swap one more time to the right and click it all over here to proceed right over here by doing that it will show up this pop-up what are you going to do just to click it all over here on this option click it on it by doing that it will open this window what are going to just uh, give you all the permission to the application by clicking that over here in the corner in this icon to allow just to return now what you're going to do you are going to click on this other option just to click it on it and now just to click on this option Give you all the control to the application if you ask you it's probably gonna be asking you to give you all the permission to the app just to give you all the control you don't need to worry about it it's 100 in your device as i just said it's 100 percent safe just to give you all the control to the app by doing that the application will start to initializing what you have to do just to be patient and wait it won't take too long just one minute two minutes depending on your device All right, as you can see, the application it has initialized it. Just to click it out over here. Just to click it out over here to proceed. All right, the application is going to be just like this. It is in Chinese. First of all, we are going to make some change on it. Change the language to do that. Just to click it out over here on this setting icon. On the setting icon, click it on it. Scroll down find this option the word icon the word icon clicking on it click on the first option click on the second option now by doing that you will have there a lot of language what you have you just select the one that you want to apply to your device to your emulator All right, we have now changed the language. Now we are going to enable Sun Serie to make this a uh, application work nicely, work work faster. So scroll down to the last option about phone or about device. We are going to enable the developer option as we did on the start. Find the build the numbers probably gonna be on the last option. Build the number clicking on it around seven time to activate the developer option. You are now a developer just to return. By doing that, you will have then a developer option unlock it. If you can find this option as we did on the start, just click on the cheesing icon right over here. Developer option, open it up, it's going to be just like this. Make sure to enable the USB debugging mode as we did on the start. Scroll down. Window animations, cable the animation off, transition animation, put the animation off as we did on the start, animate or duration to the same process, 40 GB rendering, enable this as well, 44XMSAA, enable this, okay. All right, now. I am going to be installing here the root shaker to find out if uh, uh, this have root access or not. Just to install application on this system, just to click it out over here on this application. Click it on it. By doing that, it will show up this window. It will open up this window. Click it out over here. By doing that, you will have there all the application which are installed on your android device or you're going to just click it on the app that you want to install on the system and it will be automatically be installed for example if you want to uh, install some games like free fire pubg what you have to do just click it on the application and it will be 
just click it right over here and it will be installed easily i just want to install the root shaker to find out if this have root access just click it on the root shaker i'm going to click it on the root shaker and click it right over here by doing that the application will be installed just to return as you can see we have just installed the root shaker clicking on the root shaker agree swap to the right swap to the right and click it right over here and get started just click on verify root as you can see congratulations root ss is probably installed on this device easy and simple without using a computer without having my device without using any kind of recovery like the wrb or anything like that okay guys i will start from you hope this video help you out if this video help you out please leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed to yet i'll give the notification to get notified about new video and i'll see you guys on the next one peace out